10 ways to optimize your gaming PC for more FPS in 2021. I will also include 3 bonus tips at the end. My first tip is to download CCleaner. It can analyze everything that doesn't need to be in your system and you have the option to clean it. For example, if you select the recycle bin, temporary files, downloads, and browser cache, it can clear everything that isn't necessary that hogs the system's resources so you can have smoother gameplay. It also has other tools like disk analyzer, software updater, and a drive wiper. My second tip is to improve FPS is downloading Razer Cortex. Razer Cortex helps optimize gaming specifically. You can select the game or optimizers and check the boxes of what you want running in the background. You can check third party applications and Windows tasks running in the background. It also shows how much RAM it is able to free by doing this. It also checks your minimum and maximum FPS per game. It also has a system booster, but I do recommend you use the C Cleaner one. Tip number three is setting high performance mode. To do this, go to Windows Search and type Edit Power Plan. Click on Power Options on the top. Now, select High Performance Mode. This favors more performance, but uses more energy. This isn't going to spike up your electricity bill, but it will use more system resources and power to get you to higher frames in games, as well as a faster PC overall. I also have Ultimate Performance option, which you can get, but it does require a couple steps, so I highly suggest you to search it up. Ultimate Performance is basically high performance, but more power. I recommend high performance for most people. Tip number 4 is to limit the use of Spotify and Discord. These applications use a lot of CPU power, but if Discord is required for the game you're playing, I suggest turning off hardware acceleration by going into the settings and clicking on Advanced. This tip also goes for other applications like Chrome and Firefox. My next tip is to disable notifications. Notifications are not just consuming more power, but they also block your screen and make a sound while you're playing. This can be annoying. I suggest turning off notifications in Windows and leaving out the most crucial ones. And no, that doesn't mean Discord. Tip number 6 helps optimize your disk. Go to your disk, which is usually in the C drive, and right click on properties. This brings up two options. Go to disk cleanup and select the options you want to clean up. I suggest all of them. Next, click clean up. Once you're done, go to the tools tab and click on optimize and defragment drive. Tip number 7 would optimize the effects and memory usage. Type advanced system and this should pop up. Click on performance and check every box. This would make it look less appealing but it will make windows look snappier and feel more quick rather than better looking. You wouldn't notice most of these effects anyways. Tip number 8 is to turn off background apps. Go to settings and search for background apps. Next turn off all the background apps. These won't close when you have them open. They will just not be running in the background even if you don't have them open. I suggest keeping some apps like Windows Security and other Windows apps because they do help with performance. Tip number 9 is to turn down the graphics of your current game. Not just the details, but everything else. So let's say for example in Valorant, this applies for every game, but in Valorant, anti-aliasing you will want to turn off for most games, details, effects, textures. Turn off shadows, bullet tracers, and special effects also help. This also improves the way you see enemies because you're getting rid of all the non-essential features. This makes you more focused on the players. I also discussed this on a video called Why Do Pro Gamers Use Low Settings. Turning on full screen would increase FPS as well and decrease input lag. Finally, I suggest capping your FPS one level higher than your monitor. For example, instead of 60Hz, put 75. Instead of 144, put 160. This would make your FPS more consistent and more smooth while not using a lot of GPU power. Tip 10 is to get a better GPU. I'm just kidding. It's to disable full screen optimizations and override high DPI scaling. This decreases the amount of clutter you see and makes the gameplay get all the full screen benefits when it comes to FPS. I do have 3 more bonus tips that you should just generally know if you have a PC. One is to always update your driver software as well as Windows. 
This could get you more features and optimize your GPU. Tip 2 is to not download an antivirus. If anything, declutter your PC. Windows protection is going to be fine 99% of the time if you at least have some knowledge of what you're downloading. And even for surprise downloads, it still blocks almost all of them. The last tip is to take care of your PC. Don't put it in a tight area. Clean your fans at least once a year. Don't overclock too hard. And don't leave too little space on your hard drive or SSD.